Previously on a dream machine. Yo, brother. My God, what happened here? You want me to patch you up, sir? No thanks, son. My granddaughter will will do that when she comes back. You won't survive, sir. You're gonna lose so much blood. In fact, I'm surprised you, you didn't even lose any. Or, probably you did. No, what I'm trying to say is... Acorns! Okay. What can I do? What can I do? Twigs, small animals. Hmm. He, they're saying it's too neat. So... Maybe... Hey, old man, um... I don't know if this works, but can I have your blood? Hello again. I hope you excuse me not getting up. I have to go. Go on ahead, son. I need to catch my breath a bit. So hold on, can I do this? He's suffering enough. Bored? Nope. Huh, so I cannot use his blood. Hmm. Hold on. Hello again. I hope you excuse me not getting up. Uh, are you alright? No. Well, you see, I'm fucking dying. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, okay, um. What happened to you? You know, you see, you see. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm, yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, I have to go. Can I... I should make myself bloody. Question is... How? Can I use these blood? Can I use these? No. Can I do anything here? No. How can I make myself bloody? Hit myself? I already dig myself. Ha 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 ha! Not funny. Any? Can I take this blood? Duff the blood smear the path. Yeah. Can you can you smear it on yourself? Blood smear the path. This? I don't need to reinforce it. Can I beat the shit out of it? Destroy the. Uh, can I put a yarn? <clears throat> Trying to yarn directly to the cage wouldn't do much good. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I don't need to modify it. Anything? No? Can I take this blood? can I do? <clears throat> hmm. Hey, buddy. Can I? I know you might get blood loss. Oh no no! Ow! Are you hurt? You mean the bandage? It's nothing to worry about. That's a good to hear. Uh, for a moment there, I thought the thief had struck again. Uh, 
Is it the same thing? It is the same thing. What happened? I was attacked by the organ thief again, and you know what? And yeah, mother, and you know when I was looking at sleeping, he took my freaking you know caps, e caps. Yep. Cool story, right? No. All right. I have to go. Can I help you some way? No offense, but I no offense, but I doubt it. You know, you're not an actual a doctor, so get the fuck out. Okay, I have to go. You're fine. You know where to find me if you need me. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Uh, if I just smear blood on myself, it would work. But where can I get that blood? It's not like I could, you know, hit or kill or stab myself. So what the am I supposed to do? <sighs> Hold on. Is it possible if I could smear blood or ink, right? On the real world, and maybe it will transfer it to the dream world. But what blood? Or ink? I think I used it all too. I have to use Mr. Morton's hand, but I don't think. Uh... I don't know. This has to do with something. I feel like. But there's nothing to do but mushrooms and shit. <gasps> Wait. I think I got it. Dig the shit up. Why you don't need them, Yarnet? Wood damaged mush. They don't look hurt. How about this one? Can you dig this one up? I don't need it. Can you dig a hole? No? Could you use this on here? Oh my god. I smeared some blood on the bandage. Thank you. Alright, I got this. I should have done that in the first place. Alright. Guys, I'm hurt. Ouch. Owie. Ow. Boo boo. There he is. There he is again. He got a bandage on his arm. This time, he actually appears to be injured. You there. What happened to you? I got jumped by an organ thief, sir. Bastard knocked me out and nearly took my arm off. Well, I'll be damned. I, I thought you were... You were our man. I'm, I'm sorry to disappoint you. Don't worry about it. In fact, your arrival is most timely. Mo most timely indeed. Why is that? Uh, our scout hasn't showed up for her... Patrol, you see. She's probably home sleeping or something. She, she's, she's probably dead. Uh, where do I fit in? We'd be much obliged if you help us. If you helped us look for her. Uh, how should we do that? Divide into small groups and search the forest, or, or are you gonna let everything on me and let me, or? I mean, what I'm trying to say is, are you going to just let me do all the work, and you guys just do nothing? Probably, yes. That's, that is the problem. We can't leave the spot. I fucking knew it. The organ thief was last seen running down this path. So, now we're standing guard here, to prevent more creatures from getting attacked. What's in it for me? Nothing. Expect, except our gratitude. And that goes a long way these days. Oh, fucking. Well, we'll be your new best friends. <laughs> Alright, I'll try to find her for you. Yeah. Is 
that blood? Yes, it is. Can I... Can, can, can I... Not even. Okay. Can I go through here? You. Any news? Have you found her yet? I don't know where to go. Not yet. I'm still searching. Don't take a del don't take all day. Ah. Oh, whatever. Who are you guys? We're patrol squad, Whiskey Tango. We're a part of the Valley mi mil <clears throat> Militia. Mil Militia, I mean. You guys are actually organized? Of course. What did you think, sir? That we were just some lynch moms out of blood? Yes. Cause we're not. We're trained professionals. S strictly by the books. <laughs> How long have you been in the militia? For about three weeks. But don't let that fool you. We're as professionals as they come. We, we get we get these things done, you see. <laughs> No! What did you do before you joined? I was a tailor before and I found my true calling. When I heard about the militia, I put my scissors down and joined that very same day. I've always felt I was meant for more than hemming folds and backstitching doilies. And look at me now, eh? Group leader Melvin Dunn, at your service. I used to work as a day laborer at some of the local farms. I used to be a school teacher. <laughs> You're fucked up as a school teacher, just to let you know. I'm looking for a young woman named Samothy. Understandable, since you're being attacked. We haven't seen her in a while. She usually out, patching up victims on the previous night. We're lucky to have her. Really lucky? She chased after the organ thief in the middle of the night. She might have come past here? That was before we got here. Our shift started at dawn. We haven't seen anyone since. Except for you. <sighs> Can I join? I'm afraid not. You don't have to require training for field operation. How do I get that? Back at the base camp. Two hours march due south of here. South? But don't bother. We're already a full squad. No room for the dead weights. <laughs> I gotta go. Stay out of trouble, son. Yeah. Where do you think you're going? I uh, just want to see what's down this path. I'm afraid we can't let you do that. The organ thief was last seen heading in that direction. We're standing guard here to make sure no one else is hurt. Those paths are for members of the militia only. Yeah, but I just told you. Selma Thied chased after the organ thief. So, you know... Maybe, uh, let me through and help her, huh? Hello? Does that come to your mind? Huh? Ah, <sighs> fucking A. Goddamn fake ass military. Alright. Wow. What can I. There's a path here and a path there. And an examine water wheel. And that's about it. An old water wheel has fallen over and lies rotten in the underground. Undergrowth. Huh, do I see blood? No, do I see blood? No. Let's take this path. Whoa. Whoa. 
Is that a face? The rock vaguely resembles the shape of a face. Yeah, that's what I thought. It's overgrown and crumbled. A, remin a remnant from the past night's... Ah, the remnant from the past night's dream, perhaps. Huh. Let's uh, examine. The window's been boarded up tightly. I see nothing but darkness on the side, inside. I think this place used to be an old mill. The door wouldn't budge. I think it's been nailed shut. Whoever left this place didn't want people rub rummaging inside. Yeah, let's go. This looks like a puzzle. Wah, wah. A water lily is bubbling gently in the water. Same shit, I bet. A water, yep, a water lily is bubbling gently on the water. Whoa, 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 huh? A fork twig. It's a pretty unspectacular twig. Can I... Huh? Too short to reach. How about that? Too short to reach. Oh my god! <laughs> I did not notice her. What the shit? I was focused on a lily pad and this twig and not- Oh my god, what the hell are you? Are you the organ thief? Hello? Hello, mister. Are you alright? I guess. I'm not sure. I don't know anymore. What happened to you? I lost my heart. I think I must have dropped it here. In the tarn. Can you see it from me over there, mister? No. Are you sure you dropped it? No. But what other explanation could there be? Somebody must have stolen it? That's possible too, I guess. But why would anyone do such a thing? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I just, uh, I'm trying to find out. Do you know anything about the organ thief? Organ? Thief? What's that? Never mind. Are you human? Holy shit. Have you seen any weird tentacles around? You mean snakes? Sort of. But a lot bigger. In that case, I haven't seen them. There are plenty of toads around here. Some of them are really big. Toads, eh? Have you seen a black wall around here? You know about that too? I thought it was the only one. It's... Somewhere beyond, beyond, behind me. I can feel the eyes staring at me sometimes. My friend went too close to them. Your friend? Yes. The Boo Moose. Do you know him? I'm afraid not. Hmm. I feel like you've been isolated from the townspeople. I have to go. I'll be right here. You, you want me to... Should I throw this bandage over there? No thanks. I'm sure Selma will be around sooner or later. Oh, you know Selma. She'll... She'll help me. You want yarn? What do you think about this ball of yarn? I don't like it. <laughs> and I'm sorry. Cool. You mind if I take this? Not at all. Would you like, you, would you think of a, a, what do you, this board, what do you think? They're beautiful. I built a house from boards just like that. What do you think about my shovel? It's very pretty. 
I have one just like that back at my house. Wait, did I? Took her stuff? You look really creepy. My god. I'm going. <sighs> oh. There's a big hole in the roof of this place. Uh huh. You know what? Can I? I jammed the blade between the door and the frame, but I'm unable to wedge it open. Twig that shit? The twig won't be able to open it. Uh huh. Board it up some more. It's already boarded up. Want me to tickle you? Mm hmm. That's so. Anything else? Lost your legs. Hello. Huh? Stay back. I'm warning you. I can pierce a ladybug eyeball with this thing. Ch chill. I'm not here to steal your organs. I hope so, for your sake. If I so much as smell a knife. I'm putting an arrow right between your eyes. What the hell happened? What do you think? I got jumped by the organ thief, of course. What did it... How did it happen? Last night, as I, as I was on my way to the patrol meeting, I got jumped from behind and had both my legs chopped off. Damn. Just like that. Must have used... One hell of a blade, and it was over in a matter of seconds. Seconds. Okay, when did the attack occur? Yesterday, just after supper. It's probably why he pinned me so easily. All my energy was in my, in my belly. I've been sitting here since then, defending myself against wild animals and worse. I'm so. Tired. I can't even keep my bow up. Well, shit. The patrol is looking for you. They're taking their sweet ass time. I've been sitting here all night waiting for them to come get me. It's a good thing you have happened by. You can point them in my direction. I'm out of arrows, so I won't be able to defend this position any longer. Holy shit. All right, uh, what's, yeah, what's in it for me? <laughs> you know, yeah, I'll tell you. Great. You can have my bow as a reward once I'm rescued. I don't have any arrows left. But, but, the bow is still good, a good deterrent. If they don't look too carefully. If they don't, if you don't look too carefully. I'll go talk to them. Thanks. Did you? Never mind. I thought I heard something. I'm looking for a young woman in Salmathid. Then stand in line, buddy. Lots of people need her help these days. Just look at me. You think this bleeding will stop itself? Uh, you don't. You don't know where she is. I take. I haven't seen her in a few days. She lives with her grandfather not far from here. He might want to try there. I tried that, uh, he doesn't know either. Yo. I don't know what you guys are made of. I don't know if you guys are human or not, but, uh... Yeah. You stop bleeding. In fact, you're not losing any blood, it seems. 
Aha. Not much, unfortunately. Oh shit, I didn't even read what I pressed. Oh, about Organ Thief. Who is he? That's still a mystery. Despite countless attacks, nobody has gotten a clear look at him. But I think his luck will run out. Sooner or later, his attack has been increasing in frequency. I think he's getting overconfident. <laughs> he's bound to slip up and make a mistake any day now. That's when we'll pounce. So, uh, why is he stealing organs? Frankly, I think he eats them. Mm -hmm. He got some ap appetite for flesh. A cannibal. What other explanation could there be? Hmm? He's probably gnawing away at my legs as we speak. I hope he chokes on them and die. What does he look like? Aside from wearing a dark cloak, we don't know. He attacks during nighttime and moves like nothing like I've seen before. I could swear his feet didn't even touch the ground. You know... I think his tentacle in disguise. Like what happened in Eddie's dream. Yeah. I have to go. See you around. Is that your stomach growling? Whatever. Let's uh... Oh, da, 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 da. These mushrooms have red caps and white stalks. Cool! What's that? Uh, small mushrooms, small mushrooms are growing on a rotten log. Cool! Cool! Not what I need. Two small mushrooms grow by the path. I don't recognize them. Cool! Yo, what is this ritualistic looking thing? Why does it feel like Navajo for some reason? Oh, the BGM. Or the flute, or whatever that thing's called. I forgot what it's called. These candles seem to be made of bees. Whoa, that's cool. Let's check the pumpkin. It has flies. Great. Some jack-o'-lantern are sitting in the pumpkin's patch. They've seen better days. Is it him? It kind of, it kind of looked like him. What makes you say that? The slightly orange skin tone. The round, bald head. That, that stem like turf of hair. Well, I am not convinced. Who do I look like? The higher of our kingdom. Oops, wrong voice. Have you come to claim your throne? Eh? Yeah. Eh, uh, no? Who am I supposed to be? The higher two? Why, the Pumpkin King, of course! Which would make you... The Pumpkin Prince! That's blasphemy! We can't just give the throne to anyone with a passing resemblance! It could be a confidence trickster, for all we know! What makes you think I'm a prince? You look like just your father. Or our father. Only slightly more human. I guess we can't be totally sure, though. I say, let him perform the test. Only then can we be certain. What the fuck are you guys talking about? According to the old legend... Only the true hire to the throne will be able to pull the forked scepter from the shore of the enchanted lake. Forked scepter? You mean this twig? He, he has pulled it from the shore. 
Only the true hire would be able to do that. He is, he is the ward. Well, I'll be damned. I apologize for not believing you early, sir, sire. My stubborn doubt blinded me. Don't worry about it. That's most gracious of you, my liege. So now that I have the scepter, uh, what happens? Now you can claim your throne. And rule this land for as long as you live. This little pumpkin patch is mine now. The great and proud pumpkin nation. Sire, if we are to crown you, we must first know your name. Uh, I'm Victor Neff. All hail, King of Victor the First. Supreme ruler of the pumpkin patch. Let the festi festiv festivities commence. Huzzah! I gotta go. Well, s well, safeguard your kingdom is your absence, sire. Yeah, I'm a pumpkin king now. The king returns! What is the bidding, your highness? Who are you guys? We're your cabinet of ministers. I'm your minister of foreign affairs. Foreign affairs? I'm your minister of finance. I'm your minister of defense. I'm your minister of interior. Give me a situation report. What shape... Is the kingdom in? Years, years is neglected has left the kingdom in a desired state. Our enemy to the south is amassing, amassing, I mean, its army along our border. I'm afraid on attack will, might be imminent, sire. What do you suggest? Build a forti fortification line along the border. We must not let the land be overrun. Uh... I gotta go. Well, safeguard your kingdom in your absence, sire. Okay. I'm guessing I could put them on the side so I could get through. Which I will do, but before that. Whoa, 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 the, There's a bunch of eggs in the nest. No, leave it. Not yet. Yeah, before I even do any of these, let me, uh, knock the door. Who's there? My name is Victor Neff, ma'am. Another... Hmm. Another mob member here to harass me, eh? Hey? No, I'm, I'm not. You have three seconds to get off my porch. Or I'll fling you to one of the corners of this forest. Are you the witch? I just want to talk to you. Three? I'm, I'm just looking for someone. Two. Okay, I'm leaving. Wise move. I pussied out! <laughs>